And welcome back to the 42nd studio vlog edition. Hello, hi, welcome. If you don't know much about me, hello, hi, I am Candy or Candice. And this is the place where I like to take you guys on my art adventures when I'm not working full time in the animation industry. And if you are returning, thanks so much for coming back. You guys are so freaking amazing. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And just tell me what you guys are enjoying about the last bits of summer we have left. All right, uh, first off, I wanna say sorry for the previous studio vlog, 41, coming out a touch late. That is because we've had some house things that needed taken care of with the duct work. If you are part of my other socials, you guys would have seen that. Uh, but aside from that, it is all steam ahead for next month's Patreon stuff. I want to show you guys what I've been doing so you guys have voted. And here are the stickers for my Patreons for this coming month. Here we have our mini sticker mail and then our full size sticker mail here which I am so excited with how they turned out. And I always come up with two and the spare always goes up on my Etsy shop. So that is this guy here. Also, thank you to everyone that's been buying this past month. You guys are so freaking awesome. I am so ecstatic to say that all of my fall stickers have been doing really well, as well as my Halloween stickers and things like that already. So I just wanted to say a big awesome thank you so much to everyone because it's not just like one or two stickers, like a lot of bulk orders are happening and I, from the bottom of my heart, I just wanted to say thank you, thank you, thank you so very much. Honestly, I would not be doing this if it wasn't for you guys. The other cool thing is I just hit 2,000, just over 2,500 sales on my Etsy shop. Woo, party! So anyways, I'm just really excited, guys. The other thing I wanted to show you guys, because I had a fail the other time around, and this will be a tutorial that will be coming out a little bit later, but my round stickers went super super well i think i might make them a touch smaller next time because i think they might be a smidgen large but i am super happy with how these look i think they turned out absolutely freaking fantastic but on that wonderful note it is about time for me to have some dins as well as uh after dinner i've got to edit the studio vlog on a monday night Woo! And yeah, so I will see you guys in a little bit. Go oh, bye!
We are walking from our super, oh, I realized I was holding down the microphone. We're walking from our super old neighborhood that we used to live in, which is the Rosedale area. And we are walking down to an awesome place called the Brickworks. And uh, our puppy absolutely loves coming here. She is definitely a puppy that enjoys trails and things like that and I want to take her on more so here we are I've actually streamed this before funnily enough last year but yeah it was shocking oh 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 oh, oh excuse me no 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 out oh, I don't see anything bad there but she shouldn't be doing that anyways We'll show you the area. Do you want to go this way? Go that way, Jim. Do you want to go this way? Maybe if you take her, she would. Some of them I think are new. What happened to all the historical stuff that used to be on the walls here? Oh, maybe they moved it, see? Probably shouldn't drink that water, should she? There's turtles and all kinds of who knows what in it. Your call. Which way we want to go? Must be went that way. Has puppy spoken? I think so. Well, I'm just gonna say how are you doing in your life? I'm fine. Okay. How are you? Welcome back. I guess this is working well enough. Today is the 6th of September. I'm hanging out in our front area with a puppy. Look how cozy she is. Puppy, say hi. Hi, cozy puppy. She gets pillows. I tell you, this dog is spoiled. Anyways, <clears throat> I'm setting up here just to be cozy with the puppy today and I want to get going on some of my older designs I would have shown you guys a little while back. Oh my god, I am... Hello? Camera? <laughs> there we go. Okay, there we go. It found me again. <laughs> so, anyways, um, I have all of those older designs where I did, you know, themed desserts like strawberry and chocolate and stuff like that and matcha. And then I've got other ones like the fish waffles and the bubble tea that I would love, love, love to get done. I also need to start ramping up my designs and stuff for next month's Patreon rewards. I'm thinking fall. I'm thinking cozy because I think you guys like those more than Halloween -y stickers I might come up with one Halloween sticker. I feel like I've got a lot a lot a lot on my plate I don't know if I'm gonna get it all done for next month But what I'm gonna do is at least do the outline for all of my older designs and then get going on my roughs for two autumn sticker designs one so that, you know, the polls so that my patrons can vote. And then another one that is a Halloween theme because I, sorry, we had an ambulance go by or a fire truck. Um, and also my husband's doing work underneath the deck because like I've told you in the past, uh, he 
where we noticed that one of the vents on this side, this vent right here was not working. And so long story short, he is under there. The vent is now connected. He's just re-insulating because they didn't insulate properly down there. So that is what he's doing. And um, I'm just, I'm happy that I'm, I'm honestly, I'm feeling a lot better. I still like to sleep in a lot, but I definitely don't have the morning sickness problem that I had from before. Also, super big news guys, I'm having a girl. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm having a girl. I'm so excited. I didn't really care if I had a girl or boy, but it is very exciting that I am having a little baby girl. Right, Jen, you're gonna be a big sister. I'm so excited. Um, oh, and about the earlier footage from the Brickworks, I hope you guys don't mind the little history session there. I thought it'd be kind of neat to explain all of that because it's a really neat historical landmark and it's always funny how landmarks like that are always found by accident like this guy was just digging a post for a fence or it's like this other guy that ended up finding that there was like this huge cave underneath his property this is in the US but he, the way he found out there was a cave there was because the cows and things would hang out by this bush and for some reason it was always cold by this bush and then long story short they found that there was this massive cave you know so it's kind of really crazy how you just stumble upon these things by accident so i hope you guys enjoyed that blog and oh my god we saw a beaver hut and a beaver cleaning itself that's what that footage is that you would have just seen um this studio vlog is also going to come out a day late because we're going to be at the cottage so i did like half the editing already for last week's footage and now it's the start of a new week so we're doing the new footage and stuff I don't know how much footage I'm gonna really have from this week but anyways uh, I've got a lot of work to do and a puppy is falling asleep beside me it is so beautiful I love her waddliness okay this brings me joy this stuff right here brings me the most joy in the world it's like a stress reliever if you're having a bad day you just, you got you gotta just squish the jowliness on a puppy. There's just so much love right here, I swear. Oh, and I also went to a wedding. This is why this whole month is so messy. So we went to a wedding on Friday for uh, one of my good friends that I've known for absolutely ages. I keep doing this because I'm like, focus on my face, focus on, on the brightness. Come on, brightness. Um, anyway, so that was... Uh, a two, an hour and a half ish drive to get to a place called Kitchener um, which isn't too too bad but then next weekend we're going to the cottage that's why the, the studio vlog is going to come out late and then the weekend after that we are going to be doing Chris's birthday slash his cousin has a reception for their wedding because they already got married in the summer springtime but this is because the covid restrictions have been lifted a bit so we can all get together and see everybody so anyways okay time for us to get going with some art me thinks okay see you guys in a bit
Hey everyone and welcome to the end of this studio vlog. Before we ended, I wanted to show you guys some stuff I've been working on. Now, I've been working super hard on my Patreon sticker sheets and as you know, I always do two sets for them to vote on and then the other one goes to my Etsy shop. I've also been working on a memo pad. I've been working on a Halloween sticker sheet and also a the wallpaper for my patrons for next month. So I wanted to show you guys all of the hard work I've been doing and I've been doing this all in the span. I did this all last week. like. I started doing the roughs last week and then I've been doing all of my fills and my lights and my darks and all of that good stuff. So there is one of the Halloween sticker sheets, or the fall sticker sheets. And here is the second with the same color palettes. So these are the ones that Patreon is going to vote on. Here's a memo pad with my color swatches as well. I've been having a lot of fun drawing mushrooms in this particular way. This is my Halloween sticker sheet. I'm not done yet. I'm not done any of these because I still have to do the outline for all of them, but I wanted a good head start on everything because we're already the 13th, so we're already in the middle of the month. And then here is going to be the wallpaper as well. So yeah, I'm super, super happy with that. Um, and I did a lot of this work at the cottage. I also need to edit the studio vlog after work today. I've got, I wanna finish working on these, the outline and the, the lights and darks on this, on the sticker sheets this week as well so that I can start formatting and printing and cutting for next week kind of thing. Um, what else do I have going on? I still need to also do a podcast for my patrons. I am so sorry. But at this time, I also wanted to say thank you to all of my patrons. You guys are so freaking amazing. And I love your faces. Thank you so much for being here. If you got this far in the video, put a pumpkin or a leaf down in the comment section below just to tell me that you got this far. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Let me know what kind of videos you would like in the future. And I feel like the rest of this month is gonna be a little bit weird for me posting up studio vlogs because all of my studio vlogs are on weekends when I'm busy not being at home and doing other things. So it's a little um, <coughs> time crunchy and stressful. <laughs> but hopefully next month will get a little bit better. I, I'm not holding my breath because Thanksgiving and I don't even know what's happening because of COVID. I'm just so nervous about everything. <laughs> Anyways, on that wonderful note, I will see you guys on the next studio vlog and or how-to video. The next how-to video that's coming out is the much anticipated, much weighted uh, video all about my printer. So I hope you guys find that super helpful and I will see you guys on the next one. Goodbye.